Hey, hey, good people. Arthur Morris here. I hope all is well. Uh, so in this video, we're going to look at uh, writing equivalent rational expressions with polynomial denominators. So we have 4x over x minus 7, and we want to know what do we multiply x minus 7 by to get x times to get x minus 7 times x plus 2. Again, if you choose to divide, you can. You can just look and see what factor is different in comparison to the first and the second one. So I went from x minus 7 to x minus 7 times x plus 2. So that tells me I know I had to multiply by x plus 2 because that was not in my first denominator. However, if you need to come out to the side, you can. And you can, again, divide each one of those. I uh, divide the new one by the original to see what was multiplied. So if I divide that, I see that I can simplify or cancel out the x minus 7. And that leaves me with x plus 2. And what that tells me is that I had to multiply this first denominator by x plus 2 to get that new denominator over there. Whatever I do in my denominator there, I need to do in my numerator to keep the fraction equivalent. So that gives me 4x times x plus 2. So 4x over x minus 7 is equivalent to 4x times x plus 2 over x minus 7 times x plus 2. So we were just trying to figure out what do I what did I multiply x minus 7 by to get to that new denominator and whatever I multiply by to get to the new denominator I have to multiply my original numerator by the exact same factor or factors okay so that's all there is to that again we'll use this when we start adding and subtracting rational expressions which will be very soon uh, i hope you find this found this video to be helpful make sure you continue to practice and i will see you on the next one thank you